Hey YouTube, welcome to another episode of Automoto Mods. On today's episode, we actually have kind of a two-in-one deal. Um, we're going to be revealing a new car that we just added to our garage, uh, as well as we're going to be doing some wheel changing, uh, color changing with Plastidip. Um, I'll get more into this in another video if you haven't heard of it. Uh, it's basically a rubberized coating. It peels easy, it looks great, uh, it's really easy to apply, it's really good for a DIY. So let's get to it. Now the first thing you're going to want to do before you start spraying is make sure that the, the face of the wheel is perfectly clean and dry. Any water, any contamination will obviously ruin the finish. Um, I'm just going to use some simple green here to clean the, uh, clean the wheel f free of any dirt, any grease, anything like that. I'm not cleaning the barrels, I'm not going to be spraying them. That may happen in a later video, but for now that's just what we're going to do. Um, so I'll come back when that's done. Alright, so now that the wheel is clean, uh, we can go ahead and start laying our first coat. Um, now we're going to be using this uh, <clears throat> The anthracite gray, it's a metallic gray. Um, basically, uh, it's pretty straightforward. The first two coats you want to run lightly, maybe 50% coverage over the entire surface. Uh, and then the last two coats you want to lay down a little bit thick, so that way it evens out and lays down nice and smooth. Uh, don't forget um, to wear a respirator if you're going to be doing this somewhat indoors. I'm in the garage right now with the door wide open. Uh, make sure it's ventilated because this stuff obviously is not something you want to get in your lungs. But uh, anyway, let's not lay down the first coat here now. You can watch and then we'll, uh, we'll come back. Now some of you may be wondering why I didn't mask off the tire. Um, in a lot of cases it's not necessary. Um, it'll just peel off the tire when it's done. If you're not sure what I'm talking about, I'll show you at the end. Uh, but uh, if you do want to, you can run uh, cards around the outside of the wheel, but that's really just going to be um, getting, making it more difficult to get into the edge and the lip of the wheel because you want to make sure you cover the entire wheel properly, otherwise it's not going to hold up. All right, so now we've got two coats down. Uh, it's time to lay the third and fourth coats. Now for the three and four, you wanna lay it on fairly thick. You, we, we want one solid coat rather than just a light misting. Um, now the reason for that is, is that one solid coat will basically level out better and look a lot smoother. So I'm gonna go ahead and put on those last two coats and then we'll come back and we'll see where we're at. Now this last step is optional. I'm using the Plastidip Glossifier here to add a layer of shine to the wheels. It just makes the metallic look of the anthracite pop just a bit more. Make sure that if you do use the Glossifier to lay it on in one steady thick coat so it levels out and looks really nice. Okay, so now we've got um, four coats of the anthracite gray as well as one coat of Glossifier. Um, now this is where I'm going to show you basically why I didn't put cards or, or tape off the rest of the tire. Um, it's a little bit tedious, but rubber gloves help to get a grip. Basically you just start an edge, like so, and then just start peeling it up, like this. This isn't going to get all of it, but it will get the most of it off. The rest of it, you just take your finger, on your, if you have a rubber glove, and just basically wipe it off. And you can see it starts to come off there. It's a little bit thick here as well, so that should peel. But just keep doing that until they're all cleaned off. Alright, so there's the finished product. I've got all the... Uh, Plastic cleared off the uh, the outside of the tire. Actually, a, a, a 
The thick bristle uh, plastic brush for doing dishes works great for this, just to get in the cracks and stuff. Uh, and you can see the glossifier really makes that metallic shine pop out of the gray. So basically all it's left to do is do this same thing on the other three wheels, put it back on the car and check it out. Alright guys, thanks for watching. I really hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. We've got more videos coming out. There's always some more in the works. So check us out. Follow us on Facebook. And we'll see you next time on Automotive Mods.